Hey, welcome back to more Layers of Fear. So, I have opened these two up. I'm not sure what that means. I don't know if these signify like different chapters or just sections in this game. But so far, I've done two of whatever this is out of six. So yeah, let's continue on to um, whichever we're going next. Hello. It's about time for us to talk, don't you think? I mean, I've seen you in my house so many times, and yet I could never find the courage to face you directly. Not until now. Their lights started to fall apart. Everything he touched turned to rot. All right, so it looks like we're back in the front of the house. This is where the entrance is. What says, Henry Marvin, MD, Relationship Counselor. Ooh, that's not good. Telephone number 225 East 5th Street, March 3rd. This time, we're really going. Oh, this is not the living room. Look, honey, it's your favorite. Come, sit with me, like in the old times. Yeah, it's a bottle of Castillo. Nice, nice. Looks like the expensive stuff. Which makes sense for an artist like myself. I will get you, you furry leeches. Get out of my house. Whoa, why does it look weird? You see that little effect there? Looks like some sort of anomaly. Oh, okay, yeah, that's why. I just remembered that of the lantern. I forgot, cause like, it's not on my face constantly, so I have to like, press the triggers for it to come up. But don't worry, I now remember. Oh my God, what's up? Hello, little dolly. What you got there for Everything me? I touch breaks. This house is sick. The world is breaking around us. Everything I touch breaks. Yeah, it seems like that way. Blood is thick of it. It is. You're correct. Good, solid undercut. Primer that will hold it all together so it doesn't rot. Do you guys think that Layers of Fear would make would make a great like live action adaptative movie? Whoa. Like can they make a movie out of Layers of Fear? I feel like it's possible. Got some more anomalies over here. What is that? <gasps> Collectible. Yeah, in the last one, I missed out like two or three pieces, which kind of pissed me off. Oh, I saw someone there. Yeah, so in this remake for Layers of Fear 1, they added a threat, and that was shown in the demo, so I wonder when For a limited time, gotta run past him. Uh, go faster, painter. What are you doing? Oh, okay. Is there like a button to just bring up my lantern? Okay, I see now. Gotcha. So I can just bring it up, but it'll still like has that limit. What happens if I go all the way up? Does it like overheat or something? 
Oh, uh, okay, gotcha. Cleaning this house is a nightmare. We don't even use the fireplace that often, and ash is everywhere. Grandfather Clock, you okay? What is wrong with you? Oh, what is that? I saw that. That was a different picture. I've been here before. This crossroad. Painting. An ugly one. It's a man laughing. Whoa. Angry. It's simpleton. I ain't no simp. Everyone's a critic. Blind fools. Cretans. Is there words everywhere in the walls? This house is a mess. You're still a lady of the house, remember? I'm terribly sorry for your inconvenience, but we've seen no fluctuations of power in your area and see no issues in the neighborhood. And since you didn't allow entry to our electricians, uh, we cannot help you in any way. Sincerely, Adam S. Power Company. Too close on me? Are you locked? Oh my god, you son of a bitch. Yellow. Who's making a goddamn mess in my house? And I don't know the combination. Be back later. Gotta be on the wall somewhere. Can I open you? No, I can't reach you. Shattered thoughts. Oh, wow. Now everything's right side up. What's that I grab? Do I have like some sort of like inventory thing that I can look at? Because I grabbed something in the corner, but I can't really look at it. Looks like. Hold on, look, look closer. Oh, okay. So upon further further look, it there's arrows that goes left, right, left, and it shows X X X. So I'm assuming those X's, I'm supposed to find out what numbers those are and which order it goes into. Or maybe when I find the number, it'll put the order for me. Oh my god, the numbers are right there in the save. Okay, um, what's that, 10, 70, 90? There we go, much better. Sorry, it took me a little bit. I don't remember how to use the combination. And I got the K. I can put it between the books. He'll never find it there. 
You put the key between the books. Well, that was a good idea. Sucks I left the note out. You know I never read. Actually, you know what? I just bought a book, actually. Hold on. Let me see if I can grab it. I was doing this long running bit where um, I said I bought this book probably like almost a year ago now. Oh, no, not really. It was a couple months ago. I bought a the like the first deluxe edition of Berserk. And I was doing this like running bit where like, oh, I bought a book, but I never read it, which legitimately I haven't read a single page of it yet. But um, I'm going to do the same bit, with the, but with a different book. So I just bought this book called Playground. Um, and I did read it. But uh, I think just one chapter, which is like, what, like five pages or something? I don't know. Three pages? And um, that was like, I think that was like, like a month ago where um, I started reading, but uh, I just never picked it back up. And I want to because it seems like a interesting book. It's like a whole genre that I've never really thought about that authors would make. It's like, oh, that's interesting. So like, uh -huh, bye. Huh, read. Huh. Um. Man, there's a lot of stairs. Anomaly. Ooh, I got the key. Anomaly. Got none. Anomaly. Collectible. Nice like those. Anomaly. And nothing. Okay, it's a picture of some weights. Them like counterweights. Is it too late to turn it all around? Well, I don't know. Do you hear a phone? Such determination, such blindness. Wait a minute, I think I remember this circle. Isn't this one of the endings from the original? Where like you're just going like in a big loop around in a circle? a perfectly good phone. Why would you do that? That's probably very expensive. What do we have here? Silent floaters. They clock the drains. Oh, fur in the water. No baths for me. And that's all. Anything else? Oh, you're going to play that way? Okay, yeah, you know what? I'll uh, fine. I'm not like her. 
I won't let go. I won't let my passion decay. I can't. I would never. I will finish it. If I am to be honest, I can't say your letter was unexpected. Numerous colleagues have informed me that you had previously sought their advice in this matter, and while it is perfectly understandable for a patient to demand a second opinion, I would think 16 concurring opinions would be enough. Still, out of respect for you and your wife, I have examined the case thoroughly, and I have to concur with my colleagues. Involuntary muscle spasms are not uncommon with patients who have suffered burns as severe as your wife did. What you refer to as a freakish grin, or an unnerving yelp, though many would find such expressions hurtful, could indeed be manifestations of nerve damage. The other symptoms you mentioned do not seem to be physiological, but rather purely psychological in nature. Traumatic events can lead to severe stress, and that is nothing to be ashamed of. As to your demand that we fix your wife, you have to understand that what she went through cannot be undone with one simple procedure. It is a long, arduous process that will require all your strength and support. Please feel free to contact me or my colleagues should you wish to discuss a long-term rehabilitation program. Another fucking quack, Robert Richards, MD. You don't know anything. What are you painting? Where'd you come from? Oh wait, the room changed. This thing, this family won't work if you keep undermining me. It will break apart. It's locked. Gotta find another key it's somewhere. Oh. Your fault. I did nothing wrong. Don't blame me for your mistakes. Drinking that ruins the family? <laughs> this is childish. Do you call me childish? Me? Yeah, maybe a little bit. <gasps> I got a crowbar. Can I fight with it? I got a five. Is that for another combination? In the end, this was the only instrument she could play. The only music this family could accept. I got a three, five, what? Uh, let's try three, one. Got it. Cold mercy. 
merciless light is still light. Huh? What was that? What'd you do? I heard something, but I didn't see it. Constantly flapping, eating other rats. Eating other rats? They're in the walls. They're in the goddamn walls! Are you insane with those candles? You will burn. We have electricity. Ooh, you're back. How about you go away for a little bit? Fantastic. Ooh, my God, you're right there. Waking up here. Did I die? Now, where am I? Huh, okay. All right, now I'm back here. And the threat's still around. Where are you? Two numbers is better than three. That was a close one. All right, six one. What the f Okay. I saw that. You're trying to block the door. Without it, I'm broken. I have to finish it. All right, let's try this again. Finally managed to play a little. If banging on the keys awkwardly counts as playing, I won't lie. It drives me insane not to have full control of my fingers. In any case, I was promptly berated by my loving husband, who said I should be resting. I know he means well. But how will I ever get better if I don't work at it? The worst thing is, I could swear I smelled liquor on his breath. Oh, God, please. Not this again. Got a piano. It's making the furniture dance. What 
what's going on? My heartbeat's going higher. jar and a plastic tubing. I... Welcome back home. Thing that could make her smile. Looks like I'm missing a couple stuff. What is it like a phone? We will get you, you furry leeches. I will get you. I will get you. Getting smart. Looks fine here. It's all normal. Oh, the it's the baby painting. Look at that. Okay, all that looks normal. Let's go back out from where he came from. Maybe that's where I'm supposed to go. Nope, never mind. Oh, here, here it is, of course. Look, honey, it's your favorite. Hit a little bit of dabble here and there. back here now this where it gets interesting all changed when the daughter was born wow the reward for the most cliche line goes to me can I finally start exploring this whole place You were not like that before.
We had an agreement. A deadline that you prolonged for the third time now. If you don't finish this screenplay, someone else will. Was that? Come on! What happened to you when your daughter was born? Tell me! In here. I'm scared. Mom, it's night. I think you just had a bad dream. Everything will be okay in the morning. I imagine the lighthouse gets lonely, but come on. It's you who wanted to go there. No, you don't understand. It's dark. It's awful, and I can't write. Everything is... Hello? Hello? Uh-oh, I gotta go check on the generator in the basement. Fuck. Now that's no way to greet your muse. What your surprise? Creation isn't pretty. You pushed a human being into the world, and now you need to do the same with a book. I'm here to help you with that. How? How? She asks. <laughs> the same way I helped the painter, the musician, and the actor. All you have to do is choose. Your voice will be heard. It won't. It never is. I saw you. Can't hide from me. What are you doing here? And now, with my help, it's possible. Do you choose to use it? Say it. I do. I choose your help. Then, it is done. What did you do? Hello? Oh, thank God you're okay. What happened? What do you mean? I, uh... You were scared, and the call was cut off, and... Oh, that? That's nothing. The generator died. It's fine now. Oh. Okay. I guess that's good. How do you feel? You sounded upset. I'm worried. I'm good. Mm, but... I'm good, son. It's as you said, I'm exactly in the place I wanted to be. Are you? Yes, I'm sure. I need to get back to work. Good night. Love you. She is suddenly way more chipper now. Am I possessed or something? Did something happen? Yeah, I'll just go back and type my thing out. Gotta go back into writing mode. What's over here? They wanted to protect her. Wanted her to be happy. But sometimes wanting isn't enough. Sometimes wanting good things turned you into a monster. Don't ride city buses. 
This is your chance to end segregation. Segregation? That sucks. Moths drawn to the fire between them. No matter if it the flame was desire, despair, or hate. All right, crack the old knuckles and get the typing. Painter's Story, Chapter Four. Back to this old BS. Okay, so I guess these do represent chapters. Because right now I'm doing four out of six, and right now it's chapter four. Makes sense. He tried to pull himself together. So, the lady, she's pretty much writing out this story right here. I guess that's like what this whole thing's about. This is all her fictional story. Marriage Guide, Kids in Marriage, Expect the Unexpected, The Everyday Magic of Parenthood. The new book by Molly Pierce, Purse, is a must read for parents who are expecting their first child and went, want, want to create a happy, healthy environment for the baby. Or now we receive a full set, a, wait, free set of motivational tapes, strong enough, volume one and two. Hello. Hush, daddy's here. Okay, it's gonna be one of these, huh? I'll play our game. Sometimes you must be in the dark to see. Door number two. Hopeless. Number three. Delirious. Number four. Drunk. Oh, that looks freaky. Even though you've not been born yet, I can already feel your presence. It's simply amazing. I just can't believe how lucky I am. A year ago, all I had was talent and ambition. Now, against all odds, I have a career, a loving husband, and you. I've never been a deeply religious person. I guess what other people look for in a sermon, I found in perfecting my art. But now, I can't help but feel like there's a higher power watching over me. They once told me that I would never succeed as a musician. Now, I'm playing sold out concerts at some of the most prestigious venues in the country. They also said I had a difficult character and that I would never find a soulmate. 
guess again. Finally, a doctor once told me that I would never be able to have children of my own. And yet, here you are, within me. I am quite possibly the happiest woman in the world. I love you so much. Yeah, good job for proving all those people wrong. Now, what is that sound I'm hearing? Is that just a marked door? Oh, you're drawing. Can I see? It's a uh, man. Who's this supposed to be? Y you good? You look pretty creative. God, I am such an idiot. To think. Oops, sorry. Did not mean to skip that. Press the wrong button. As for your question, my sister tells me that Anne Blackwood is an extraordinary childminder. From what I saw, she deserves such praise. Your friend and lawyer, James Jerome Sadler. Oh, that's not good. That's not funny. Don't laugh at that. Oh, I saw you. Don't you try to hide from me. Anomaly. God damn you. Why are you doing this to me? I'm sorry, I don't mean to. Hey, have a little tea party. Can I join you? I can get crunked up on tea if I wanted to. Got you. I don't like the sounds. There's a flower talking behind our backs. Whose backs? 
What kind of accusations are you accusing me of? I had to move most of the dolls out of her room. It was getting ridiculous. You can't just throw gifts at her whenever you feel guilty for... whatever it is you feel guilty for. She needs a father, not another useless distraction. Looks like a daughter mourning for a, a dead mom. Oh, oh, I saw you. You're right there, sitting down. Who are you even playing with? I don't know, man. I'm just trying to survive. Oh, we got a broken heart. Time for you to choose a side. <laughs> What? What's so funny? You see, Birdie, if you move it here and here, bam. Ah, oh, damn you. You beat me again. <laughs> Sometimes I wonder why I even bother. My little bird loved this game. Okay, so I was supposed to lose. What do you stand to win? I need some peace and quiet to work. Is that too much to ask? This house is not a playground! Your child is barely two years old. It's absolutely normal that she doesn't talk yet. It's not the nanny's fault, and no. Stimulating your daughter's mind by reading her Nietzsche is not a good idea. For God's sake. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Hey there. I know she adores that toy, but I don't know. Something about it is very unsettling. Maybe it's the way she plays with it. She's not a happy child, but shows sometimes when she plays. It breaks my heart to see it. No, don't do that. Don't just move out of nowhere like that. That's not a good doll. Another piece of the puzzle. God damn it. Hey, what's up? Is that your daughter? What? No. Of course cutting your hair doesn't hurt, Bertie. Anomaly. What the? Okay, shows the mom and the daughter having fun outside while the dad, me, is staying indoors and paying the bills. That's what I'm supposed to do. I bring in the food on the table.
Which dreams sh should I chase? Oh, whoa. That's, yeah, I don't like random small things running around. It's not a fear or anything. It just looks really weird. Gone. Oh my god. Uh, okay. Was I supposed to, I was supposed to put my lantern? I think so. What's going on? I I mean I know how this game works. It's just like a bunch of mind-boggling things that's supposed to trip you out. But still, is this supposed to be funny? endangered your child, then yes, it is reasonable to let go of her. But maybe you should give her one more chance. Mrs. Blackwood does know how to mind children. No. No more chances. No more risk. Alright, so the arrow's pointing up. Up. Straight left and right. Which way should I go? Freaky. Earlier today, a typical quiet and peaceful neighborhood witnessed a scene straight out of a crime drama as social services accompanied by armed police officers descended upon the residence of a once famous painter and a recent widower. Apparently the man had broken into a children's care center downtown and absconded with one of the young patients. Our sources claim that the girl was in fact the culprit's daughter, who had previously been removed from his care after a family court ruling. After unsuccessful attempts at negotiation, fearing that the man might harm the child, police officers stormed the building and apprehended the suspect. Eyewitnesses claim that as the paramedics escorted the girl out of the house, the man, still in handcuffs, fell to his knees and repeatedly exclaimed, Please, she's all I have left. A truly tragic turn. Absconded with one of the young patients. What does that mean? Absconded. Is that like another word for bad bad stuff? Huh? 
I feel like I should follow you. Anomaly. Oh, no. Whoa. There was a dog. Okay, quick, quick question. Which way is out? It's not this way. Okay, what am I looking for here? Oh, what's up? Hey, what is that? day is it? Does it matter the day? I think she's right behind me. Oh my god, you're right there. Holy Lord. shit. Cat, I know where that is. Well, I think I know where it is. Wasn't there a cat door somewhere in the downstairs? Or was that like a rat? 
That's a rat. Uh, there was a cat door, was there not? There it is, found it. Recky. Holy crap, that was so tense. Almost got me a couple times. Near the blueberry bush by the Emerald Creek. Be an example. Finish it! Finish. That looks nice. Look at all this. Did I grab a key? What was that? Man, that was weird. This was a special brush, like a horsehair brush, but different. At that point, I hesitated. Will this really work? Fuck it. I was already halfway through, and besides, it's not like I can just put it all back and forget the whole thing. Right. Uh, 
All right, do a little bit more dabbling. No, no dabbling. Oh, now it suddenly works. That's weird. I was oh maybe because it's too close. There it is. That's almost a classic face that everyone loves in Layers of Fear. All right. Um, you know what? I'll end it off right here, and I can do the last two chapters in the next video. So yeah. I hope you're watching. There's uh, some, you know, a little bit of goofs, a little bit of spooks here. And uh, I'll see you next time when I post next. Bye.